What's going on guys? Um I'm surprised that I'm doing this video. I I cannot believe I'm doing this. It is it is 6:48 and it is I'm recording this Monday. And the reason why I did not uh do this video like last week was because of political reasons and I was not sure how comfortable I am expressing my opinions about like for example uh, voting or you know all that because it's all you hear in the news these days and in the media and I don't want you guys to have to sit there and listen to me tell you which who do I think should be president or who I think should not be president because I'm not here to do that I'm not here to do that but this episode, season two, episode three, they done fucked it up. You done fucked it up, okay? You done, you done fucked it up, and you can't unfuck it now because you already set the setting of how you want the episode to be or how you want your universe to be now. You have, you You are trying to jump in the future and say... Oh, Hillary is elected, so we're going to have Hillary uh, be the president in our show because we're not trying to be Marvel, apparently, or, or some bullshit like that, right? First of all, I am not going to tell you who I want to be president. I'm just going to let you know that there are things I disagree with Hillary and there are things I disagree with Trump. And there are reasons why I would want one of them to be elected and reasons why I would not want them to be elected. I'm just going to say that. I'm not going to go any further. That's all I'm going to say. So they have Hillary come in, and I think I know what they're going to do. They're going to have Hillary in the show be some kind of alien or something. And that's what, the, that's what they're going to do. And it's it's so bad. It's so bad that... I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to say spoilers in the video. I'm gonna have to literally put after the after season season two episode three spoilers because there's no other way to describe this to you without telling you is that it's political. It's a it's a it's a political it's a political it's a political episode. The entire episode is political. Everything. The way Supergirl feels about the president, the way um, people feel about the president, the way that people react to that, the way people feel about uh, discrimination against immigrants. The whole episode was political. And I watch these shows to get away from the po po the politics. And I'm... I'm irritated that I had to sit there and watch this, and and I shit you not, this makes me want to go back and watch Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., because I'd rather watch Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Ghost Rider than watch a political episode about Supergirl. Gotta say that now, because it's ridiculous. If you, I'm in my kitchen, by the way. This is my kitchen. Part of my kitchen. That's what this entire video was. This this entire um, episode. It was just political. There's nothing much to review, nothing much to say, but it was just a political video. And if you're sick of politics, I'm sorry if you watched it. <laughs> if you haven't watched it yet, good. Good for you. Don't feel bad that you missed the show. Honestly, I don't know if I'm going to review it. I don't know if I'm going to review it because... I don't want to see more political acts with this show. If I see more of that, I'm going to stop watching. You guys got to stop wa doing that. Stop. Don't do politics. You're going to piss people off. You're going to lose half of, no, not even half, more than half of the people who watch your show because you're trying to reel certain people in and you're trying to get rid of some. I, honestly, I'm going in circles. What I'm trying to say is you're 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 taking a stance in something 
no one should be standing in. You, sh I don't feel like public display, it's good to say, oh, I'm a Republican. Oh, I'm a Democrat. Oh, I want this person to be voted for president. I want this vote person to be voted for president. No. Uh, and I gotta say, the only, when I was watching this episode, I was so mad that they did politics that I was sitting there, like, hoping, I was w hoping that the supervillain was going to win. I was like, damn! Redhead girl, fucking... Huge ass boobs, like, and spits and just throws fire at you, and she 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 looked like she she would have beat Supergirl, and I'm sitting there, I'm like, well, damn, this is like, this is like the thing in Injustice in the comic where Superman would have lost if it wasn't for his backup all the time, because then because because then Supergirl's sister saves her from the fire chick, and then they're gone, and then they win, right? And I'm like, damn it, I wanted the supervillain to win this time, like, the only positive thing about this episode was the cheesiest ass introduction to Miss Martian ever. Mar uh, Martian goes, um, he, Martian goes in, he's in the bar, the, the bar full of uh, secret immigrants of different planets, right? Because they came to Earth. He's like, he because he comes to the bar, the, the bartender, and the bartender is like stunned because it's a Martian. So she's like going out the back. Uh, John's following her, and, and then she reveals herself that in the back of the bar, and that's the end of the episode. That is the end of the episode. There is nothing else to say is that all you see is po politics, immigration, and Ms. Martian. That is it. I just told you the entire fucking plot. There you go. Now, how do I feel about this episode? Well, you know how I feel. This episode was garbage. Man, this episode was awful. I hated this episode. I hated that they inter they put politics into the TV show. I don't like that. Do not put politics into the show. Do not do it. I don't care if it's called Supergirl. I don't care if it's called um fucking um Superwoman. I don't care. But you're not going to shove it down people's thro throats like, "Oh, because it's Supergirl." We got to have the woman to be president. I hope I I'm I don't I don't know what to say, guys. I I really don't know what to say. I I just I really do not like this episode. Uh even even if it was Trump, if it was Trump, I'd still be like the fuck? You're still jumping future ahead. You're not... Why are you doing politics? Don't do politics. That's all I'm trying to say. Politics, being politically correct, is ruining America. Politi being politically correct is ruining America because everyone's starting to think like that. Everyone's starting to think, oh, politically correct. You gotta be politically correct with the way you talk. You gotta be politically correct with the way you act, the way you walk talk everything it's bullshit you shouldn't do that that's wrong and that's not what this video is about but i just want to put that out there because that's the truth and that that's that's what my channel is called super mike okay super mike i'm he 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 does what's right and what's right is is not to put politics into the shows right now it's not a good idea leave it out do not put it back in there I know what you're doing. I know what you're fucking doing. You're trying to make a plot twist, and that's really stupid. It's not cool. No, I'm not enjoying it. And I and I don't know, because I, I didn't watch any people review it. Because I didn't want to hear them say it was good, because it wasn't good. It was just, it was just to support a campaign. 
And it's disappointing because you see that out there. You see, oh, you got people like Miley Cyrus. You got people like Katy Perry going to people's dorms and, and knocking on their doors and, and influencing them to, to pick Hillary. Bitches, it's, you're not your fucking choice, first of all. It is not your fucking choice. It, it is their choice. And, and people should be smart and they should pick a president that they want because it's, it fits what they want. Not because, oh, it's a woman and it'd be really cool for us to have a woman in, as president. Or it would be really cool for us to fix our money or get rid of them damn immigrants. No, the point is you, you need to be smart. When you go out there and you vote... I'm, I'm glad I have people on this channel who don't need to worry about voting. Because this year is going to be tough. i got to be one of those people who's got to vote. And I got, I'm going to tell you this right now. I, I have already made up my mind. And you guys probably might feel what, what I'm going to pick. Who I'm going to pick. But what I'm trying to tell you is don't judge me based off of who I'm, who I'm going to pick. It does not change anything. But my point is... Don't put that in TV shows. Don't put that in Supergirl. Don't feel like you need to do that as a plot device. Don't don't do that. I mean that that's not cool, man. That's don't influence people either to to pick this. Like Madonna, she said, "Oh, I'll give someone a BJ. I'll give all the guys BJs if they pick De Democrat Democrat uh, Hillary Clinton." I'm sitting there, I'm thinking to myself, like, why? Like, you want a woman as president? But you have no self-respect to sit there and, and, and that's not, you're, that's not self-respect. You're gonna, you're gonna influence people to vote for Hillary by saying I'm gonna give you a BJ. Are you fucking serious? I'm, I, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm done, man. I'm done. Uh, I apologize that this video was, it had to involve politics. I apologize that I'm talking about this. Um, and I just want to tell those people out there that, that it's, it's whatever, whoever we get, it's going to be rough either way. Whatever president we get, whatever president it is, whatever, it, it's still going to be, we're still going to have our our disagreements if with any of them with any of them trump or hillary we're gonna have our disagreements and i'm sure there are people even democrats they're like i don't agree with things she says i don't agree with this or that it's you know what i mean like but anyway that's just my two cents uh this this video was got is probably gonna be disliked a lot and i i really hope that's not what it is I'm going to be straight up honest with you guys, and if you guys don't want to hear this, then you can just be done with the video. But this is basically where I stand. I'm a Republican. I am a Republican. I, I at first, was going to pick Trump because he's a Republican, right? But then I did research. I watched the debate. I, wa I, I read articles about both candidates, and I s still think I still think that Trump would be better. And I think trying to sit there and be ignorant and just wanting a, a president that is a woman to be president instead of what can she actually do for America, that's wrong. You should want America to succeed. You should not want it to be destroyed because you want to make history. We could be with we could be at war with Russia the moment they say that Hillary won. As soon a bomb could drop from the fucking sky, you don't know. And other people on the other side of the world don't accept it. America can, but. But not not other countries. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Democrats. I'm sorry, Hillary Hillary fans. I'm sorry. But I'm I'm not trying to be a jerk. I'm not trying to say that, oh, I'm right, you're wrong. I'm just trying to say that this is a rough debate. 
and there are pros and cons to each side and you need to be smart about who you pick. You need to do research and you need to make up your mind about who should really be president and to benefit America. Well, anyway, that's my two cents on politics and Supergirl, episode three, season two. Keep rock and rolling, and I'll see you on the next episode because I'm missing the first three minutes of the show, I think. So, yeah. Bye, guys.